Right. Yeah, I am back, and now we can uh, start chapter 10. Answer the phone. Uh, hello. Hey, Vito, it's Eddie. Hey, Eddie, what's up? I need you to hey, come Eddie, over to Joe's up? right now. Uh, yeah, oh, okay, all right, what's happening? I, I can't tell you over the phone. All right, I'll be right there. My, uh, the thing was delicious. My chicken, uh, chicken and egg breakfast burrito thing. Beautiful. Sorry, I was trying to do the chef's kiss and I was like, yes, good. Expensive suit and hat. What does this look like? Ah. Ah, yeah. Let's rock it. Let's rock it and roll it. Hop in. Actually, let's take our own, uh, oh. Your space to remove vehicle. Can I put the the car into the garage? Actually, yeah, parking in the garage. I want you to park that car in my garage. Stupid. Adjusted engine. Which car to take? I literally don't know which one. This one? No, I think it's gonna be a boat. Literally weighs 5,000 pounds. I'm trying to find the lightest one, but the highest. Honestly, this might be the latest one, but I don't like the way it looks. Alright, whatever. Let's repair this car and take this one. Oh shoot, I forgot we're running out of fuel still. Run over here. Oh my god. I just repaired this thing. This thing literally has too much horsepower. Yes. We're 80. We're in the rich parts. There, you're walking into into my car. All right. Almost done there, boss. Be back on the road in no time. Oh, I can see the uh, the dial now. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Watch it, boys. Actually, not bad. Watch and learn, boys. Whip it. Yeah, you knew. Whip it real good. Oh, 
Oh my god. Pedal to the metal. Boys, I don't know how he didn't die yet. Holy crap. Oh. Don't mind me. <laughs> Good thing the cop shows up after. Let's uh let's fix this thing up real quick. Yeah, I'm gonna need you to repair the car, man. <laughs> repair the car. Change wheels. Are you Let's see. For a new set of wheels? Take your pick, pal. Quiet here. Ooh, actually, uh, yeah. Why not? Change plate. Repaint. Here you go. Pick a design. Whoa. Well, oh, that's actually kind of cool. I didn't know you could do that. I actually like it base like without one, but it's still pretty cool. Repaint, sports tuning. We can tune it again. Oh, you can tune it white? Yo. What? I didn't know you could tune it so many times. I thought you can only do it like once. Maybe that's why we were having so many issues with this car. Or maybe it's just specifically this car that can be tuned so many times. Now it actually handles not bad. Still a little bit understeer, but it's it's doable. not spinning out on the corners damn it's actually pretty sick what is going on with his his like his neckline of the suit is like popping up uh, we're talking to joe man i went on with a baseball bat and they looked like they were scared till morning, yesterday fellas. oh hey good morning vito marty what are you doing here joe said you needed help and since i did good with the greases he said he'd take me along again Take you along again for what exactly? They're waiting for you. Yeah, well, uh, uh I'll talk to you later. <laughs> yeah, that's my man Vito. <laughs> Close the door on my man. Hi, Vito. Take a seat. Hey, guys. Hi, Vito. <sighs> so what's happening? I heard how you got rid of Luca, Vito. Good job. Thanks to you, we now have proof that Clemente was behind the attack on our guys. We couldn't do anything to him openly till now. He just cut his own throat. He kidnapped and tortured our guys, and that means war. Anything we do now, I'm going to be able to justify before the commission. Alberto knows this, so he's going to act quickly and try and come after us first. So we're going to take out Clemente. Exactly. Turns out Clemente called a big meeting in the Empire Arms Hotel today. This is our best chance to get rid of him and his top guys. Oh, sure, yeah. We'll just waltz right in there and kill a few dozen heavily armed men in broad daylight. In the nicest hotel in town. Is that about right? Don't worry. I got a plan. Shit. Joe, put that thing away. Eddie, don't worry. It's safe. I just got to press Christ this. For Christ's sake, put it away <laughs> now. Okay. What's the matter with you? Okay. You're such a chicken shit. Okay, okay. So now we're going to walk right dynamite. blow up the nicest hotel in town. Isn't that overkill? Don't worry. This thing ain't that powerful. It won't My blow hands up the are whole so cold right now. But everybody in the room where it goes off is dead meat. How are we gonna know when to detonate it? We'll use a window washing platform. We'll almost be able to watch it explode. Since when are you the smart one? Okay, fellas. I'm counting on you. If all goes well, I'll have something nice for you. When it's over, call Eddie at this number. Oh, by the way, I closed the bar today, just in case Alberto tried something. Hey, good luck, fellas. Hey, what about that kid in the hallway? You mean Marty? Uh, he ain't part of the organization, so he had to wait outside. I mean, why is he here at all? Why do you think? He's going with us because we need a getaway driver and somebody to cover our asses. What do you got against him anyway? i known him since he was a little kid, and he saved my ass with them greases. Yeah, but we're not fighting a bunch of drunk dirtbags this time. 
We're about to take out the most powerful family in this city, and you're bringing a kid. And how old were you when you started doing this shit? You're talking like you're some old fart. Look, Vito, he's gonna <laughs> wait in the car outside and drive us away. That's it. He ain't even gonna know what we're doing there. He's a great driver, and that's exactly what we need on this one. Okay, Joe, whatever. But I'm telling you right now, this is a bad idea. Oh, man. We can't take up my new car out. Hey, hey, Joe. So, uh, what kind of job is it? Hey, Joe, Joe's, Joe's car. Yabish. Oh, okay. Yabish. Hey, if you need it, I got my piece right here. Yeah, slow down, Billy the Kid, all right? It's not going to be necessary. Let's just go. You take my car. All right, I'll drive. Don't go busting it up on the way there. This is our getaway car. Plus, I'm pretty sure that. You know, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> this thing goes off, we're all dead. Explosives? <laughs> yeah, for a little fireworks show. Forget you heard that. <laughs> we're going to the Empire Arms. Ironic how he already says. Just don't we go driving it, uh, messing it up on our way there. Instantly crashes in, into a car as we're leaving, or as we're pulling out. Oh my god. Sorry, sorry. Won't happen again. I'm gonna have to give you a fine for this. Pay the fine. Alright, money well spent. Alright, I don't want to see your face again. Fellas, come on, tell me what's going down at the hotel, huh? Hey, I wonder on. if we can do, do anything book? to Joe's car. You everything you need to know. Hey, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm Yo. just curious. You know, all this secrecy. Marty, all this secrecy is important. The less you know, the better off you are. And if you keep asking questions, I'm just going to have to find somebody hey, else to drive us next time. Take okay, okay. Bell. No more questions. Sure, sure, whatever. There you go. So you're gonna blow the hotel sky high, huh? Marty! Huh. Sorry, sorry. One more word out of you. All right, sorry. Not another word. Cross my heart. Yeah, I'm not gonna do any of that. Repaint, though. We can paint it any color you like. Take your pick. There we go. Let's tune it up for uh, good old Joe here. Much better. Now we got a good getaway car. Oh my god. In pursuit of a speeding vehicle. Right oh, sir, you're gonna have to catch me for this one. Hey, you just went through a red light. And Alright, here's the hotel. The entrance to the garage is on the other side. in there and hey we got to leave all our guns in the car the last thing we need is one of clementi's goons searching us and finding them all right Vito and me you'll go in and do what needs to be done you wait for us here when you hear a big boom start the car up because you're going to need to get the hell out of here pronto and you won't need that gun unless somebody follows us but that shouldn't happen okay okay i got you joe clemente rented the entire 18th floor third one from the top there's a couple of suites and conference rooms up there and guards so how are we gonna get up there 
Round the back through the laundry room. Why the laundry room. Before we do this? Wise ass. The meeting hasn't started yet. <laughs> we'll grab some hotel worker uniforms, then we'll go do a little cleaning upstairs. Seriously, when did you become the smart one? Fuck off. There's supposed to be a guy waiting for us inside with the uniforms. Let's go. And we don't want to make a ruckus before Clemente gets here. So don't go doing nothing stupid. <laughs> Shouldn't I be telling you that? The kid's sitting in the brand new... Stay here. Upgraded uh, car. Where's the fucking bridesmaid? Ah, shit. It's closed. The idiot was supposed to leave it open for us. Now we gotta wait and hope that asshole shows up. Fuck! Can't we just get in some other way? Hey! Yeah? You see Ting Lao? Yeah? Well, where is he? He go on smoke break. Sorry, I couldn't get here sooner. Another minute, you would have been late to your own damn funeral. Sorry, I was. All right, enough. Just get the hell out of here. See, I got it all under control. Come on, let's go pick up our uniforms. <laughs> yeah, I could have opened it myself. Are these them? Yep. Ding ding. Vito, one more thing. Here, put this on. Are you fucking serious? So nobody recognizes us. Just put it on. <laughs> Great. Let's go. Hey, you two. Get over here. Yes, sir. Clean up this fucking mess, you idiots. Ah, okay. Clean this shit up, will you? Somebody's Clean. gonna slip and break their neck. Let's go, move it. Hey, you two. You got some more work upstairs waiting for you. Get moving. Hey, Richie, come with us. Hey, Richie, come with us. That was fucking Henry. Yeah. Haven't All seen right, him in on. a while. Let's get up there before he gets back. Yeah. Haven't seen Henry in a while. Hasn't <laughs> changed a bit. Hey, <laughs> yeah. Hope he don't come back before we do our thing. Henry's good people, even if he does work for Clemente. Ugh. Yeah, but what if he does? Don't even think about that. I feel like an idiot with this thing on my lip. Yeah? Well, what if we run into somebody <laughs> we know? This way, they won't recognize us. Fucking hope so. Better not. About damn time. Where the hell you guys been? Somebody spilled something in the conference room. Ah, perfect. Almost as if, uh... What it is. How it got there. And I'm just gonna clean it up. There's a big meeting starting soon. And the boss is gonna be too happy if the place ain't sparkling by then. So if you know what's good for you, you'll get the place spick and span and then get the fuck out of there. Take us in. These two are here to clean up the uh, mess. The mess? Oh, that mess. All right, come on, you two. One of the guys who was uh, here before, he uh, tripped and fell. The poor guy hit his head pretty uh -huh. hard. Poor guy. Six times. So now there's blood all over the fucking place. And we got a meeting that's supposed to start soon. It's very, so you gotta uh, get this shit cleaned up. Very you unfortunate that he tripped and fell just like that. Like, Fucking it's very tricks. unfortunate that this place hey, is gonna down, go up in a blaze. They're not gonna be around the body much longer. 
<laughs> yeah. Give me a hand here. I'm surprised that they wouldn't leave somebody in the uh, in the room with them. Must have hit his head pretty hard. <laughs> yeah, right. Yo, what's going on, yo, Beck? Hey, yo. Perfect. <laughs> okay, the hard part is almost over. <clears throat> Hot pot's almost over. Clean up the mess. Hey, I told you to clean it all up. There, yeah, looks like you're done. All right, you can get out of here. One second, I'm just checking something real quick. Okay. One second. Aha. Found it. I'm going to try turning this off. And then adding a new source real quick. Um, I changed it. So now what's it called? Um, hmm. I think it's in here somewhere. It's like the emotes. Okay. Which one it is image game and the eye source. Color source, audio, open VR capture. That sounds interesting. Event list, credits, sponsors, sub goal, instant replay. That, that, that. Then wheel. Apps example widget. Back in. Oh, shoot. Now I have to close this thing out. They'll still go three through too maybe it's a different plugin yeah i mean like right now i'm using i switched from stream elements to stream labs for the emote thing there but um yeah i was debating on uh switching from fossa bot back to uh stream labs we could take them out right now if we but um yeah, and we'd be dead in two seconds. I don't know. Just I might. take it easy and stick I can, to the The cool plan. thing, too, is since I have Streamlabs Prime or whatever, since I they host my website and everything, um, it's... I can set okay. my own, like, bot exercise. to do everything. Why do I gotta put so many but I don't know if I want to go through adding all the commands Pedro. and, and Pedro, timers again. I forgot something. Yeah. And I kind of like false about so. Just in case something goes wrong. This is nice. Some piece of work, huh? 1911 coal with a modified what the clip. Hell did you, uh, holds 20 tree um, so the ammo goes Also, quick. Yobex, Don't welcome go to the VIP club. These are the only two in the whole world. <laughs> Thanks. Never mind. We got to go to the window washing platform. Come on. For one reason, ooh, ooh, oh. <laughs> Gotta come down and give me a VIP service. These guys. Welcome, welcome. Let's get out of here. <laughs> oh, oh, this is like an oyster. Hold on, hold on, check it out. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Gross. Hey, what the fuck are you doing here? Shit. The okay, Vito. Here we go. Showtime. Is that the fucking best you got? Oh, you fucking break. Headshot. Is that the fucking best? Boom, headshot. Oh, oh, you're in trouble. You're fucking dead. Oh, God. Wait, where'd he go? Let's go. 
<laughs> hit his head really hard. True. Yeah, all these guys are just hitting their head really hard. We didn't do anything. That's why there all the blood is. It's just very, very slippery up here. Oh God. Show me what you got, big shot. Just like the guy in the conference room, <laughs> literally. Oh my god. You're fucking dead. Come on, think of something. Happy, up, uh, happy spooky season, by the way. Spooky. Yo, we got to do a I'm so in for it, too. We have to do like a rebel like uh, Friday or not. Maybe not Friday. Well, I mean, I'd be down to do like a weekly session for like uh, uh, Dead by Daylight for spoopy, spoopy season. Uh, and Halloween too that'd be so good some i forget somebody said it somebody said about um what the hell are you doing, <laughs> was it doing it life? for uh oh, halloween this year Jesus, since okay. you can't really do anything you anyways do you say. all right put your hands behind your back we ain't gonna hurt you stay there and we're good here's some tape tie him up tape up the cleaner you should consider yourself lucky. Yeah, I think how uh, Halloween probably won't shot. happen. I don't know. But it is in America. Yeah, literally. I don't think people are going to stop or just whatever. It's stupid. OK, get but, on. We got work to do. But yeah, unfortunately. 100 percent. I mean, luckily, my family hasn't been uh, doing anything hey. for Halloween for like the last how year. Much you got? Last Enough. year or two. So it doesn't affect me, but the roof? I guarantee there's going to be people Just walking around. Two floors and blow. So much for you being a smart one. What? This is crazy. What if the explosion Wait, I'm pretty sure in one of these too. rooms, it there's won't. something going we'll on. Barely feel it. You better not. If we fall off this thing, you're going to be dead before we hit the ground. There it is. <laughs> Here we go. Okay. This is the right floor. Vito, grab the squeegee and start off for Halloween the weekend. So we don't look I gotta connect That's not bad. Wires. What the fuck are you waiting for? I'm See picking it up. Get back to work. Sweet passion. The bongo. Ah, uh, that's it. Okay, got it. Take us up a bit. Payback's a bitch. Ah, yeah, just like clockwork. <laughs> ah, here we go. <laughs> These assholes ain't gonna Whoa! <laughs> what the hell was that? I don't know. The thing just blew. We'll barely feel it, all right? All right, all right. Let's go take a look. Whoa, oh, is everybody all right? I swear, you're like a half a retard sometimes. That's me, Vito. Yeah, it'd be unfortunate if they hit their head. Lucky bastard. You assholes! You're gonna die for this! Get away! Come on, Vito! Come on, Vito! We gotta get you. You sure made one hell of a mess. It wasn't enough. Move it. No, I didn't do anything. No, I'm gonna get you sooner or later. I'm going in. What 
Watch out! Behind him, play a Get that guy with the Tommy. You're fucking dead! Oh, easy. Yo, fucking dead. I forgot this was Mafia too. Back me up, please. Take me under the torpedo. I got the right <laughs> Ouch, he really hit his head there. <laughs> that guy really did it. <laughs> he hit his head. <laughs> he hit it real good. Just casually opening the door. What? Where's the other guy at? See you next fall, asshole. Uh -huh. I'm gonna get oh, you fuck. sooner. Ah, oh, shit. This way, Vito. You won't get through there. I won't want to get on your bed. Ah, oh, fuck. The sprinklers are going off. Really? Because I thought it was rain. Wise ass. <laughs> Fix it. The fuck? There's more of them coming. Come on, assholes. I'm waiting for you. Three, two, three. What the heck is going on here? Get out of there, lady. We ain't got nothing against you. <laughs> Next time, bring a bigger bomb, will you? Hey, how the fuck was I supposed to know Clementi will be how in the bedroom? How the? He wouldn't. Have was I supposed to know? Early. Don't worry, we'll get him. Don't worry. We'll get him. How the fuck? Oh god. Boy. You shoot like my sister. Your sisters take shots. I don't want to get on your bad side. You're fucking dead, mate. <laughs> Marty, no, Marty, no. no. Marty, shot him. He's dead, Vito. Oh, Chuck, come on. We gotta get out of here. You can't help Poor him kid, now. man. Yeah, I just away. upgraded this Let's car. Go. I'm kill the guy is quite quotable, literally. I should just add, like, you know how you can do exclamation point quotes. I should just add yeah, video game quotes into so that. Wrong, <laughs> All right, there's two of them. And you just be like, sure you if you put in like, uh, exclamation point Vito. Nah, I should, I should put in like exclamation point, like, uh, quote, and then it'll be like a quote from like Vito or like, it'll be like a quote from like Nico Bellic or like basically all these characters over the years most memorable video game quotes. I don't think this guy is even uh, part of this chase here. I could, I could. This actually worked out perfectly. Huh. <laughs> Joe's car changed in the cutscene. I changed the color and I upgraded it and tuned it and everything. And now it's, uh. Yeah, it's because these cutscenes are uh, a little bit old. Change the car behind you. Yeah, literally. That was what it looked like when I originally. Uh, now it's over. Got it. Let's go to my place. I tuned it up. I, I painted it all black. Give me Eddie's number. And uh, I changed out man. changed out the wheels. Hello. This is Joe. It's done. Everything went smooth. No, it didn't. Why? Marty's dead. What? They got Marty. All that tuning done in there. seconds, okay. literally. Okay. What about Clementine? <laughs> done. Didn't even have laptops back then. 
small price or anything like that to, uh, to tune in. Yeah, whatever. The fuck you're sorry? All right, take it easy now. All right, calm down. I'm sorry too, more than you think, but you knew the risks. You too. Hey, this was a dangerous job. You took him along, he died. What, you think the war was any different? And Eddie didn't even know the kid, so don't blame him. You should go home. Okay, well, just give me a minute to get changed. Oh. Marty. So sorry, kid. I'm sorry, kid. I am so sorry. Marty, no. Go home. No, you. I wonder if we can still pull out a uh, a car. From over here. Yo. Sweet. We can. Alright, now I kind of want to upgrade one of these other cars. <laughs> this is the new one that I have. Uh, let's see. Which one do I want to upgrade? We go with the Walter Utility. Just upgrade it like crazy. Or <laughs> upgrade this boat. Look at that. Look at them upgrades. Gold tier. I guess so it shows you. Oh no, I think that's bronze, silver, and then platinum. Maybe? I don't know. The boat. Literally, I could. I think uh, I'm nervous though. <laughs> I don't want to <laughs> just because it's too I'm too nervous for that car being like a huge wreck I'm gonna repair this though and see if I can upgrade this uh where are we going right here yeah we need to go that way anyways dude the upgrades make everything better or just one better are still not sure what or who do the upgrades make everything better or just one thing better oh it makes everything better um shoot uh yeah so like i did the other like black car that i had back there i did all the upgrades on that thing and um or well first i did the first upgrade and that thing had a lot more power but it was very very like uh like flimsy and stuff okay this car you can't even upgrade it rip um but yeah the one car i literally upgraded just one time because i thought you could only upgrade it one time but turns out you can do it three times it's either three or four and then uh when I upgraded it for the uh, the rest of the times, um, now the car is completely drivable and the handling is fine. But before that, like the power was so strong that I would spin out like and turning the the turning. There's a lot of understeer, or I mean, yeah, understeer still. So it's like hard to to go left or right. But um, the, if it was a straightaway, the car was fine. Like now, uh, I'll take that car out the next time. Probably, I think this is about to be chapter 11 here. I honestly, as a character, I think. Mafia 2 is one of my favorite games ever. It's probably within my top 10, but solely as a character in the Mafia series, 
I think after playing Mafia 1 Definitive Edition, I think Tommy Angelo is my favorite now. But I still really, really, really like Vita as a character. Um, it's just I feel like you had a, a much better connection with Vito. Or I mean with uh Tommy from the after playing the first game and seeing like the uh the effects of being in the mafia for him. BRB, alright, sounds good. Answer the phone. Hello. Yeah, uh is this a Vito? Who's asking? Vito Name's Leon. I'm the bartender at the Lone Star. I'm ringing you because Joe Barbaro gave me your number. Says he's a friend of yours. Yeah. What about him? Well, old Joe been guzzling my top shelf hooch all night long, dribbling on about some cat named Marty, and now he done just gone playing salty on me. <laughs> what the hell are you talking about? Your friend is out of control, man. He always <laughs> with his gun around and shit, and we can't talk no sense to him. <sighs> Great. Now look. I ain't looking for no trouble with you fellas. Could you please come pick his drunk ass up before he shoots somebody or somebody calls the police? Vito, you got to come on down here and Vito. pick his ass up. You coming or not? All right, I'll be right there. And hey, don't give him any more booze till I get there. I'm a try, but your friend, he ain't gonna be down with that. You dig? Hey, if you don't cut him off right now, I'm gonna cut you off when I get there. Got it? All right, man. All right. Just hurry. All right. How many people are in the bar right now? Just me now. Joint was jumping about an hour ago, but now everybody done gone and split. All right, listen. Lock the place up <laughs> till I get there. Now nah, everybody there done, done okay, gone gotcha. and split. Get down to the Lone Star to help Joe. All right, where's my clothes? I feel like that's a weird place to put your clothes right in front of the... Uh, the door. Throw on the uh, raincoat. Raincoat. Take the fast car. This guy. We actually don't spin out now. Still a lot of understeer, like I said, but... At least the bar's not far at all. Oh, Vito, you all here? Right. Where is he? Over in the corner there. Now look, I tried to cut him off, but the motherfucker was gonna air my ass out if I did. Okay, lock that door. And just give me a minute with him. Had a couple, huh? How you feeling? Vito, it's about time you showed up. Everybody went home already. Gee, Joe, I wonder why. Oh, <laughs> right. You drive here? Nah, I took a cab. I wouldn't park my car in this neighborhood. All right, finish your drink and let's go. You fellas about to leave? Marty, I'll let you out. Here's to you, kid. You went out like a man. Shit, now where'd I put my keys? I'm so <clears throat> This never should have happened. Never should have happened. Oh, Jesus! Ah, shit. You gotta be kidding me. What the fuck is wrong with you? I was just... You were just what? Shut your fucking mouth and get your drunk ass outside. All right, all right, I'm gone.
What a mess. Okay. Take Joe home. What? Why do they want to arrest me all of a sudden? What? There's like a ton of cops out of nowhere. You'll never catch me, cabbage. Go, 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 go. Oh shit. To the limit. We're just driving, so I'm gonna do that. Right, we're here. Try not to shoot anybody on the way to the front door, huh? Thanks, Vito. And hey, I'm sorry about... Look, just... Call me tomorrow, okay? Time to go dump the body. Oh boy. I can't decide whether I, I like this suit more like the trench coat and everything or the uh the new like exquisite the uh the tailored suit that uh Vito just got how are we gonna get back to our place here we go I guess technically he's dead anyway, so. Now we have to drive all the way back home. That beautiful skip drive would be wonderful. If only.
It's just having the option to do it is the nicest thing ever. Uh, being able to say, hey, don't want to drive this, this uh, the rest of the way, feeling like it's a little bit tedious, press uh, skip drive and you'll uh, In pursuit of a speeding vehicle. <laughs> be at, back at the place that you uh, need to need to get to. all good Roma's back there anyways I always forget where that turn is at go <laughs> that turn two I'll throw it in the garage. What was this? Here we go. Use bed. Checking out chapter 11, a friend of ours. Villa Scaletta, July 27th. 1951. I think this is it, boys. What the hell is that? I think this is the job. Right, I'm back. What I miss? Uh, we picked up Joe and all that. And uh, now it's it's time to get back to business. Hey, be uh, on. Henry. Long time no see. Sure. Long time. The job? Want, yeah, I think it's a the job. My car. Get into the car with Henry. And one sec. I'm actually going to just run to the bathroom like really fast. So, uno momento.